Welcome to the Lewis and Clark Virtual Experience, a new way forward. I'm Sean Murray. I'm going to be one of the main facilitators today, along with my co-facilitator, Jeff Tan. The overall goal of this program and, and using Lewis and Clark as the historical backdrop, we're going to explore five key elements of successfully building and leading a team into an uncertain future, a new way forward. Like Lewis and Clark, leaders must create and communicate a compelling vision, build a strong and cohesive team, overcome obstacles, both seen and unseen, maintain a high level of adaptive resilience, and proceed on into that future, into that new way forward. The, the metaphor there for all of us to think about is we're, we're pushing into the future, right? We're, we're forging and blazing a path, a new way forward for our teams, for our organizations. Each module will be preceded by a letter that has some pre-work for you to do in between the modules and some journaling prompt. Journaling is a major part of the Lewis and Clark expedition and it will be a significant part of our learning and discovery along this course. We're gonna have activities during each module, um, some individual activities, some group activities, a mixture of both. And then we're gonna wrap up each session with campfire chats. I sort of say, yeah, no, these are, these are important issues to us. I love the energy, the rush, the noise, just the power of it. Um, and being sensitive to the fact that not everyone likes that. Practicing in advance uh, before you have to do it under real conditions so that under real conditions, you can do it efficiently and effectively. Identifying some of the key decisions and practices and activities that Lewis and Clark initiated as leaders and then drawing lessons from that. And then we're gonna ask you to apply those lessons for about 10 minutes. With as a leader, you know, are you leading in a diverse way and, and having conversations that apply to what might interest all of your team members? Managers, we all want to think we're the supreme assessor of talent, and often we really are. But the, the power of sort of having other people on the team be a part of the selection decision. <laughs> 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 <laughs>